Now that we're signed into the Northwest ISD Google App Server, uh, noted by the login in the top right corner, you'll notice that I'm logged in as a student, we can go in and start working on creating our first site. You'll see the tools at the top uh, that are available to you. These may change based on your role, student, teacher, or administrator, but the one that we're looking for is sites. If sites is not listed, you can go to the more, and within more, you will see all of the tools that are available, some of which you have access to, some you don't. But you can scroll down through here and you can find Sites. It's listed right here under Home and Office and you can open it that way if you don't see it on top. The first time you come into Google Sites, you'll notice that this says Thinking of Creating a Website. This is replaced with your website name. So if you've already created a site, you will see the site listed here that you can click on and immediately go into. Since I don't have one, the first thing I'm going to have to do is create a site. So this uh, orange reddish button here on the top left side says create. And when I click on that, creating a site is very straightforward and very simple. There are only a few options that we have available. But the main thing, this is the number one thing that we want to make sure that our students are doing properly so that we're able to access the sites, is naming it. We want to name our site the exact username that the student uses to log in. It should match the email account before the at sign that's right here. So typically that's first dot last name. However, there are some students that have an 01 or other characters that are part of this. We want it to match identical to their email address without the at nisdtx.org. You'll notice that right below it, it says a site location. It replaces the periods because periods are not a character that are used in namings of sites with a dash. So the location of this site is going to be this slash Cooper dash Peacock versus Cooper with a period Peacock. Once you do that, all you have to do is hit create. And after a couple seconds, the site will be created. You will be in here. You'll notice it says cooper.peacock. You're at the home. Your site is now created.